breathe. What's going on is MJ, so I want to show you some basic workouts that I do at home. And the first thing we're going to do is we're going to do the squat twist. So you pretty much get in position and you squat, then you twist, and you want to make sure you do both sides. Okay? Squat, twist, squat, twist. All right? Squat, twist. All right? And you can do maybe five, um, five by ten of these. All right? Good job, you guys. All right. And so the next okay. exercise, we're actually going to have to separate this a little bit. to do it. But you're going to do high knees, right? And then you're going to squat to one side, okay? So get out of the way. Let them do it. Right. So high knees, right. all right? And, the right? and then right, yep, to go all the way down. Yep. Make sure you're feeling it right here in this area. <laughs> all right? All right. Got it? All right. High knees. All right. To the right. And make sure you're switching sides. Yep. All right. <laughs> I see Miss Tony's doing the modified version of the high knees. If you yep. can get your knees up like that, it's very simple just to get them up this way. Right? Make sure you're tucking in that stomach and you're breathing. And don't forget to do what MJ told you. Slide to the right. Oh, my gosh. <laughs> I can feel that. <laughs> this is good, people. Y'all got to try this at home. Right? Stretch. All right. So the next exercise we're going to do is we're going to do the uh, hip thrust. So you got to get down on the ground. you want to make sure that your stomach is completely flat so even when you go up um, to do the exercise make sure you don't bring your stomach up okay you want to go up so raise up all right keep your stomach flat all right and then go down all right raise up make sure you're keeping that stomach flat all right because you want right now we're focusing on the core right now all right down and up all right so again you can do three rounds of five you can do five rounds of ten it's up to you whatever you're looking to do all right and so the next exercise is going to be famous exercise but the one everyone dreads and that's going to be the plank all right <laughs> all right so you want to make sure that you get into the plank position and we're going to add a little twist so you want to get in position and you want to <laughs> if you're talking Scoot up just a little, all right? You're going to get in position, and then you're going to lift one leg. Yep. All right, so this is going to focus on the glutes. It's also going to focus on your core. For you guys at home, if you're watching Miss Tony, Miss Tony is doing a different version. If you're having problems getting down on your elbows, you can do like Miss Tony is doing. Keep yourself in that push up position. And again, don't forget what MJ tells you. Kick that leg out to the left, kick that leg out to the right. All right, let's try it again. Oh. Leg up. Oh my goodness. Down. All right. And if slowly bring it down. Ooh. All right. And if you get a little tired, just get back into the plank position and hold it. Mm -hmm. All right. So these are some of the basic workouts that I do at home, um, especially right now with all the gyms closed. Um, we're in quarantine. So these are some of the things you can do to focus on your core, your glutes, your legs, keep you in shape, keep you healthy. Mm -hmm. Yep. That's what's up. Yeah, we're going to take a quick commercial. We're going to catch our breath. We're going to get some breath. Yep, stretch out, out, breath. out a little bit. That was good. Hello, I'm Charles Obama, and I'm proud to announce the new internet television station called LDM Network. And on this station, we're going to be bringing you live talk shows, music reviews, independent music artists, 
videos, sports, live events, and much, much more. Go to www.ldmnetwork.net for more information and all the shows that are going to be on this network. Again, that's www.ldmnetwork.net. And hey, if you are an independent artist or you love to hear independent music, go to our new radio station called LDM Radio. Go to www.ldmradio.com for more information on where to listen or submit your music. Camera, this camera? Hey, welcome, welcome back to Dear Summer. If you guys are watching, it's like we're on this camera over here. Hi, people. Hey. <laughs> <laughs> and we're gonna finish showing you guys how to stay in shape at home. So again, I'm gonna turn it over to MJ. And All we're right. Gonna get busy. Time to sweat. All right, you guys. So now we're just gonna go through some workouts. So I'm gonna show you guys that you can do at home to stay in shape. All right, you guys ready? Ready. All right. So now we're gonna start with high knees. Want to make sure those knees are all the way up. Again, if you guys can't get your high knees, you get them up as high as you can. Do the modified version like you. The next thing we're going to do is we're going to keep the high knees, but this time we're going to try to make our elbows touch our knees. Okay. All right, so <laughs> switch. Yep, keep those knees up. <laughs> All right, switch. <laughs> All right, so. All right, next thing we're going to do regular squats. You guys, the squats are really important for your abs and your glutes. You really important because that's the thing now, you know, making sure the stomach is flat and everything else is fat. All right, so we're going to go ahead and do some more squats. Here we go, squats. And if you really want to focus on your balance when you're doing squats, you want to make sure your arms are all the way out. That helps you with the balance. All right. So, all right, keep going. And again, you can do as many rounds as you want, but I always say you want to make sure that you do at least three by five, which means you'll do five times, three times. All right. So the next exercise that we're going to do is um, good. Just think of the exercise. I wasn't ready. Um, it gives us that time to breathe, right? Yep. <laughs> Gotta have some breathing room. Make sure you guys at home, you're breathing, inhaling, exhaling through your mouth. If you need to see if you catch your breath, you're breathing really hard. Try to stay moving. Stopping is not going to help you catch your breath. You know what I mean? So do like I do. Act like you're dancing. Just left and right till you catch your breath. All right, so the next exercise we're going to do is pretty much like a stretch. Um, side legs really high. This is going to help with the hips and the thighs. All right, so you're going to stand up straight. All right, then switch. All right, it's better if you do this with a chair because it helps with the balance. As you can see, I'm not as balanced. Okay, <laughs> so and you can also do this with the squat. So you want to do the squat, stand up, lift your leg. All right, squat, lift your leg. All right, squat, lift your leg, squat, lift your leg. All right, and I'm just going to grab a chair real quick. They can continue to do that. I'm going to grab a chair, and I'm going to show you another exercise that you can do at home. People, if you're watching at home, you don't exactly have to go as fast as we're going. You can take your time, move at your pace, right? Throw a little bit of music going if it helps, you know, but don't stop moving, okay? All right, so... I have a chair here. You can't see it from this angle, but I do have a chair that you can use um, to also work on your glutes. So I recommend you can either do the high side or the low, low side. It's up to you. This is going to help you with your glutes also, and it's going to help you with your core. So you want to bend down on the chair here. Maybe a little too tall for that. All right. So what we're going to do is we're going to bend down on the chair, raise our legs. All right. Now right here, you're just focusing on the glutes. All right, but if you want to get the glutes and the hip workout at the same time, lift your leg, kind of come around. Oop, come around like that. Oh, don't, don't kick any anticipating, though. <laughs> All right, lift your leg, kind of come to the side here. So that's going to help with the glutes and the hips at the same time, and make sure you switch. All right, come around. Yep, you can also do this standing up. Yep, so if you want to do this standing up, just like Miss Tony is doing now, all right, so you can lift your leg around. Just got to make sure that you have the balance. 
come up, come around. All right, same thing. All right. All right, I'm gonna get this chair out of the way. All right, now we're gonna go against the wall. All right, we all know if you played sports in high school, football, basketball, running track, you know these are deadly. Um, so these are called wall sits. All right, this is really good helping with um, helping with your balance. Now to do this, in order to do this and stay balanced, you want to make sure to kind of scroll with the wall and that your arms are straight out. All right, I did play basketball in high school and I ran track, so we did this doing track practice and basketball. All right. Yeah. And if and you know if you would slide like that, then we had to start over. So Tony, don't get us to start over. All right, <laughs> all right. So I would say do this for about a minute or so. Mm -hmm. um, if you can't go for a minute, do 30 seconds, and you can rise up. But don't come all the way up. Make sure your knees are not straight. Make sure your knees are not straight, not straight, because we're gonna go back down. <laughs> oh yeah. All right. Just stay balanced. Keep your arms out like this. All right. Okay. You do 30 seconds, and of course, we're not actually doing the one minute and 30 seconds. We're just get, demonstrating what you guys can do. Right. All right, the next exercise, all right, you want to turn around, face the wall. Okay, same thing on the chair, but this time we're going to do it really fast, kind of like keep your leg up like this. So what that's doing is building the glutes up also, and it does, it's supposed to burn here in the back leg. So you're not coming all the way down, you guys. You're just kind of keeping your leg up, keeping pushing it up. Right. Yep. Woo! We're getting a little workout here, huh? Yeah. All right. We now you want to switch your leg. <laughs> switch your leg. All right. All right. Do that. You can do uh, maybe three rounds of five on this one too, or you just count out to about 30 seconds on each leg. Switch. And do another round. All right. All right, you guys. So those are some of the basic exercises that I do at home to stay in shape. We got some more, of course. Hey. You know. Another quick commercial break, and we'll sell a drink. Get ourselves together when we come back. Maybe we'll have a little bit something more for you just to finish up today. You know what I mean? We'll be right back with somebody about Sandra. Hey, everybody. I'm Will D. I am Javier Luis. I'm Alex Polanco. I'm Apolonia Cruz. And I'm Kelly Cabo. I am Charlie Fo. I am Emmanuel Anzule. Do you know one in four women will experience domestic violence during their lifetime? And domestic violence and abuse can happen to anyone. Regardless of gender, race, or other factors. Two out of three homicide cases are females who were killed by a family member or intimate partner. As domestic violence victims, they face high rates of depression, sleep disturbances, anxiety, flashbacks, and other emotional distresses. And without help, witnesses of domestic violence are more vulnerable to become abusers themselves. Thus continuing the cycle of violence in the next generation. Hello, I'm Charles Aloma. Join the LDM Network and a safe horizon and take a step into changing these facts. So if you are or know someone that is being abused, please call the City Domestic Hotline at 1-800-621-4673. So that is 1-800-621-HOPE. Speak up, speak out, and make a difference. And just know that you don't have to deal with this alone. There is help. Hey, welcome, 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 welcome. If you guys are just now catching up to the show, the show is over. You already watched everything. We did all the workouts and everything, so y'all technically are cheating. Uh, but we still have a little bit more time. You know, Miss MJ has some vitamins, some good things that you guys might be interested in that are helping increase your health and increase your workout capacity. So check it out. All right, so like I said before, those um, exercises that I showed you guys are really good uh, to help you stay in shape during the quarantine right now. But if you check out my website at myikajohnson.inc, that is M Y E K A Johnson J O H N S O N um, Inc. dot com, and you'll see why I've invested in some companies that do sponsor, you know, that really focus on nutrition, mm -hmm. health, fitness. Um, and one we do offer caps. You're someone like I've mentioned before that has multiple cheat days, like I do throughout the day, not just one. Um, so you may miss, um, you know, your the proper nutrition. Okay, so I eat. I make sure that I eat fruits and 
every day, but you know, some days I do miss out. So one of the companies I invested in gives you a capsule full of every fruit and vegetable that you need to That's intake. Dope. Yeah. So if you miss a cheat day or not, you can take these uh, capsules to help you get the full nutrition that you need. Um, also, berry. So if you guys are really into vitamin B, you need your vitamin B. Definitely. Right? That's a fact. Um, there's multiple ones. So these also offer all of those also on top of whatever vitamin that you are intaking. Okay. So it's really good. Um, if you visit the website, you'll see we have bars. We also have shakes. Um, we have different things that we offer you guys. So check out my website. Again, that's www.maikajohnson.com. Uh, or MaikaJohnsonInc.com, and that's M Y E K A Johnson J O H N S O N Inc.com. Hey, you got it. This is Dan Summer. We'll see you later. Peace. <laughs> <laughs>
really want to burn here, I wouldn't go all the way down. I would just kind of come up. Yep. And get that high five. Yep. That's what that assist does for you. Sure. I can use the basketball. Hey. Hey, I know you hey. used to play basketball. Hey. All right. So with the ball coming up. All right. Down. Okay. And this is a really good exercise. Yes, it is. It's yep. Come up. Yep. Alright. Because there's no bone there, you know. So the more you work those abs, the tighter they get, you know. Alright, so I'm gonna show you guys another exercise for the core. Alright. Um using the chair again. Time. You wanna focus on your glutes and you wanna focus on the core. Ooh, getting a little workout. Alright. So let me turn to the side so you can kind of see how you do it. So you're pretty much gonna put your leg up. So I'm gonna do this leg first. Alright. Yeah, make sure I'm balanced. Gotcha. All right. So you want to come down. Mm-hmm. Oh goodness. Yep. Whew. So you're working your abs. Uh huh. Working the booty. Getting that in. And see, for a lot of people that's having problems with uh, knee flexion, you know, this is definitely going to help and improve if you practice. You see how she's stretching yep. that knee. Maybe if you, you can't go as far as she's going, but it'll help you. If you're having issues with balance with this, yeah. Then put your arms out. Just like this helps with balance. If you want to include the basketball, medicine ball, that's there you too. Go. And um, if I have the ball, what I would do, can you hand me the ball, please? Same thing, come up. Uh huh, I like that one. I notice right. she has very, very good balance. Very good. Okay. So don't try to say ready for this, okay. but this is something you can definitely aspire to. Okay. Um, if you, if you kind of want to add a twist to it, you can just kind of, you know. Down, up, twist. So, but you want to make sure that you switch. Good. I'm just injuring everyone today, huh? So good. Okay. So, same thing. Come up. Okay. Twist. I would do both sides. Notice she's taking her time. No rushing, and she's breathing. <laughs> breathing. Uh huh. Without the chair. Yep. All right. All right. So some really good hardcore um, legs workouts for you guys. Um, so I hope you guys enjoyed it. Hey, that was dope. We appreciated MJ coming through, showing us all our home workouts. Everything was dope. Miss Tony was dope. We want to thank everybody. We want to get ready to sign off, and we're going to see you guys on the next episode. Bye, bye, Sandal. Y'all have a good night and bye. peace.